<laughs> okay, so welcome to day 36, I believe. Yeah, day 36. Okay, so welcome to day 36 of Countdown to Sonic Mania. There are only 10 days left. Um, as of the time I'm recording this video, there's still 15 days left. But uh, as of the time this video goes up, there's 10 days left. So, yeah. Either way, it's getting close. Um, also, as of the time I'm recording this video, just about an hour ago, uh, the official Sonic the Hedgehog YouTube channel uploaded the music for Stardust Speedway Act 1 in Sonic Mania, and suffice to say, it was amazing! I, now more than ever, I am super hyped for Mania. Because, like, I, I don't know, Stardust Speedway... Star Speedway Act 1's music is a lot better than what I was expecting. <laughs> yeah, so anyways, we're gonna be going through Sonic 3 and Knuckles once again, but this time as Knuckles, and when we go through as Knuckles, we are not going to be going to Flying Battery Zone, um, because as you can see over here, like, this is the file I had for Sonic and Tails, as you can see here, Flying Battery's not listed as Zone 5, it's listed as Zone 8, but, um, but before I go to, before I go to Mushroom Valley, because I'm gonna be doing like I did for Sonic and Tails, where I'm only gonna be recording the Sonic 3 stuff first, then I'm gonna go back about a week later, um, and then record the Sonic and Knuckles levels. Um, so, but before I do that, I'm going to change Flying Battery's placement again, and put it in between Carnival Night and Ice Cap, because Knuckles was not originally intended to go to Flying Battery, like, um, yeah, it was originally intended that Knuckles would not go to Flying Battery, um, throughout his story. So, we're not going to be going to Flying Battery as Knuckles in this, uh, playthrough. So, yeah. And then, also, also when we play through as, uh, when we play through as Knuckles, we're gonna be using all the Sonic and Knuckles exclusive music. So basically, well... Basically, like, invincibility music, extra life jingle, main theme, as you just heard, uh, Knuckles theme, even though I don't think it plays when you're playing as him, and then the Act 1 boss theme. All gonna be the Sonic and Knuckles versions. For Sonic and Tails, it was the Sonic 3 versions. For Knuckles, it's gonna be the Sonic and Knuckles versions. So, yeah. But anyways, I've rambled on for long enough. Let's get started. We have an opening cutscene here. Just like the one in Mushroom, well, Hill, in standalone version, but... Man, I love this music. These are probably my favorite special stages. I know I said this before already, but yeah, these are like my favorite special stages in all the classic games. And they're quite, quite frankly the easiest, in my opinion. Okay, so that's one Chaos Emerald down. We're not gonna be able to get all the Chaos Emeralds as Knuckles until uh, Marble Garden, so yeah. The reason we're not going to be able to get all the Chaos Emeralds as Knuckles until Marble Garden is because Knuckles only has access to the special stage rings in the, um, in the first act of Angel Island. Basically what I mean by that is, because, like, his act 2 is completely different from Sonic and Tails. He, uh, Sonic and Tails take the upper path, but he takes the lower path, and there are no special stage rings on the lower path. 
I didn't need to do that, he could just run, but and instead of taking the spring, I'm gonna do this. And I'm using a joystick on a controller for this, by the way. Which, so, yeah, that's... That's really saying something. I'm still doing... Because I've seen a lot of people uh, say that these are the hardest special stages in all the classic games and they could never complete them. Uh, I am using a joystick on an Xbox 360 controller and I'm still doing this without messing up. Then again, Sonic 3 and Knuckles is my favorite classic game, and it's the one I played the most as a kid, so... Yeah. And I, st I still find it funny. I grew up playing the classic Sonic games, even though I was born almost ten years after the Sonic series started. Because the Sonic series started in 1991. I was born in 2000. Like, the very, very end of 2000. I was born... December 28th, 2000. So I was born almost 10 years... I was born almost 10 years after the Sonic series started, yet I still grew up playing the classics. Probably because I had a PlayStation 2 as a kid and I had Sonic Mega Collection Plus, but still. Yeah, and like I said, Knuckles takes the lower path. Well, those rocks right there? Yeah, see, he can't... Knuckles can't get up there. See? But, yeah, he goes through there. Because he can't jump as high as uh, Sonic and Tails. So, yeah. Yeah, Knuckles can't jump as high as Sonic and Tails, and I think they did that on purpose so that, um, it would make it... Uh, so it would make it so that he goes his own routes instead of people trying to take Sonic and Tails' routes instead. Anyways, let's go here. Yeah, see, Knuckles takes the lower path. Knuckles takes the lower path in Act 1. I mean, Act 2, not Act 1. He takes the lower path in Act 2. He doesn't... He doesn't come out on Sonic and Tails' path at all. Actually. Ah, fuck. Because, like, um... close to the end here. Ah, fuck. See right here? As you can see right here, it looks like he's coming out on Sonic and Tails' path, but he's actually not. He's still on the lower path. There's just two areas in Angel Island that look identical, which is kind of weird in my opinion. Ah! God damn it, I didn't... I was gonna try and do the thing where I could kill him in eight, like hit him eight times before touching the ground, but nope. <laughs> <laughs> 